The avalanche has scattered our men. Our first task is to reunite our forces. We will need all the help we can muster to get through this pass alive. This pass is full of wolves. We must be careful. They mostly come out at night. So from one relatively straightforward mission to another, to be honest. Um, this one's a little bit finicky at the start. Don't really want to be losing any villagers or gatherers. But there are basically just enemies around everywhere. Does this guy want to keep fighting? Weird. Um, okay, there's also one over here that we want to take care of. I want to be utilizing the hero units as much as possible. What manner of beasts are these? Ein Herjar. The souls of the greatest warriors. We are doomed. So for these two, I'm going to send this one down here. These two. Gather more woods. So the Norse play very, very differently to all the other factions in this game. I think they're the best at generating favor, like by a mile, or... Like, it's not even a close contest. Any hero basically gathers... Um, favor. So you can just rack up favor really quickly. That should have Let's put a base here. As again, there's nothing really finicky or weird about this mission. It's just it's just very straightforward. Um, gonna be basically utilizing the markets to trade gold and timber for food for the most part. Timber via farms and gold via the market exchange. And then we just... It's a really weird mission because you don't... There's no... There's nothing weird and wonderful about it. It's just very straightforward. You literally build a temple. Temples like this one are the source of the beasts in this pass. We must destroy them all. The age up as soon as the temple's built. Uh, we go for Forseti because of the trolls and the healing spring. Those up. So we will defend our base eventually. The enemy will attack, but it's not until around about 10 minutes. So we've got a little while to build up our forces. In the meantime, we should be able to take down uh, this enemy base. It does gather a little bit faster. So we'll take this down, then we'll put healing spring there. Drop the upgrades and start building trolls. As we're messing with that, let's build a couple of houses. So build a marketplace when we're able. Uh, 
Settimo. Something. Something. Yes, yes, sir. Let's stop him some workers. So, dwarves are good at mining gold. Villagers are, or gatherers are good at mining wooden food, but are terrible at doing gold. And dwarves aren't very good at doing food and wood. So. It's like just a very different faction overall. We'll take the temple out first because that stops them from juicing units for the most part. One of three. Yeah, yeah. Boys on the healing. Match up now as well. I'm gonna head towards the next age, so we're gonna sell all foods. Move on to the next one. Grab a little bit of defense. We've already built the uh, marketplace, so not to worry about that. It really is just this simple, we'll just literally go from one to another. And then when we age up, we'll get a broken ass god power. Basically, just close this uh, mission out. You've already got enough to plant another healing spring, which is crazy, considering it costs a hundred. Go with Bragi for the flaming weapons. Is it legit busted? We'll save it for the third temple. And that's two of three. Skip. 
At this point, we really need a lot of this. Not too much more, and we'll just send them over here. Once these guys have finished cleaning this up, we'll send them to the team. And one flaming weapons and uh, <laughs> this mission is well and truly over. I do like the Nords. I think they're uh, they do. I say play very differently, but I like I like the faction. I like how it plays. Well, they do seem like their god powers are pretty overpowered, I think. At least they certainly feel like it, especially the flaming weapons. Well, I mean, we do this, we right click, and it dies. So quickly. <laughs> like, it's a little bit absurd. That's all I'm saying. And it lasts like a minute as well. Just watch everything melt, literally. <laughs> crazy, crazy busted god power. And that, my friends, is GG. What she wrote for this mission. An absolute steamroll of a mission. We'll have to find another way through. We are being watched. Where? Wait here. Alrighty folks, that'll about do it for this one. Um, a little bit of a shorter video this one, this time round. But thank you all so very much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. If this is the kind of content you enjoy, then please do consider subscribing to the channel. It does help support the channel and would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. And as always, I shall see you in the next video.